Well, good morning. Last time we climbed down a dry well, found an underground passage, and almost got killed by a bunch of spiders. And, well, I'd like to keep exploring a little bit. I'll probably die here, but you know what? It's fun exploring. Nothing there. A silk gland, huh? Okay, I will take it. Edder cap. It's not dead. It's just stunned. Probably not good. I found some malachite and a random backpack, the potion of greater healing, and some gold. Did I go that way? Did I go back this way? I could have sworn I saw a passage back this way. Is it dumb? Now that dumb. Just out of view. All right. Might help if we actually were, I don't know, sneaking and doing things to, like, I don't know, hide giant spider web here. Spider web bridge. Get okay. All right. So we can't get stuck on it, but it looks like it's the only way across. What is it? Control C? No. Shift C? Any attention right now. There we go. We try to cross the spider bridge. Um, a wall here. Light at village. Crack wall. Examine. It's got slashing immunity. Piercing resistance, acid immunity. Okay, so force damage against this entity is doubled. Nullified, nullified. So it'll only take half the damage from piercing. Almost every other damage is nullified, but force vulnerability. So, it's vulnerable against force. <laughs> immune to slashing damage. Um... Hmm.
don't know if I have. I'm looking to see if I have anything that isn't. What about you, dear? Unseen. Concussion smash. Aha. All right. I don't think you have anything. Piercing, hamstring shot, main hand attack, hard bolt. I don't think a vampire bite's gonna do any good. All right, dear, what can you do? That did help. I know, dear. You're not a very patient person. Wits and blades always shock. Okay. You can't do anything. What to do? I don't know, dear. Uh, Nothing. What's next? I don't know, but I don't think your fireball is going to help. It doesn't. It is completely immune to fire damage. Okay. Need of a battle. Almost right, maybe. Nope, that didn't work. Trust no one. All right, dear. Still breathing, despite everything. Uh, still breathing, despite everything. Oh dear. What is here? Blacksmith fellows. Probably should uh, be sneaking around a little bit in here. Lay in a club. Lay looks interesting. Tongs. The hammer. We already have a hammer. I I should take the tongs. Lay's out. You're in the way. Thank you. Table. Mm 
Okay. Out of sight, out of mind. Let's see what you're hiding. Nothing there. Thieves tools and shears. Be wary, this place is trapped. Yeah. That's why we're going around the edges. Okay. A bed roll. Ink. Nothing there. Nothing there. Maybe. Got it. <clears throat> wow. <laughs> I wasn't expecting. Highcliff's blueprint. And some gold. Not much gold, though. A shabby door. Did we go for it? Water staff. Interesting. Move, dear. You're always in the way. I just want these. Ah, okay, so we can pick up individual things and not have to pick everything up. Some rotten cheese. Scruffy vagabond clothes. <laughs> Rope, I will pick up. More rope? Oh, I'll take all that. Tongs and shears don't need them. Bottle rack. Nothing there. there. Nothing in any of the bottle rack. Ooh, I will take I will take lots of thieves tools more rotten cheese I don't think so crap this arm toolkit
nothing there. I'll take the robe. A pleasurable deal, the shocking truth. Below is a transcript of an interview with the writer and director of A Pleasurable Deal, Mr. Kingsley Hart. Interviewer, what was the inspiration behind this, if I may be so bold, entirely lewd piece of drama? Hart, it was about exploring the taboo, seeing who we as people really are. Yes, Robert made a deal with a Cambian, but who wouldn't, interviewer? Well, I like to think most people wouldn't, Hart. Then you don't know most people. Everyone wants something. Everyone needs something. Cambians can see it. In a way, they know us better than we know ourselves. Interviewer. But at the end of the play, Robert dies horribly. What does that say about what we, as you put it, need? Hart. You forget. Robert dies because he broke away from Carlisle. He didn't stay true to the deal they made. Interviewer. So you're encouraging people to make a pact with Hell's offspring to give up as Robert did his soul heart. We only have one life. Why not make the most of it? Interviewer. So what's your deal? Harp, I beg your pardon. Interviewer. In fact, this was your directorial debut, wasn't it? You couldn't even get published in the tabloid Baldur's Bash before this play came out. Did you honestly trade your soul for an erotic play? Harp, I, all right, we're done here. Rotten Tomato. I think. Ooh, things. I will take the rope. I will take that. Iron Torch. Ah, you can light the torches. I'll take that. Um, okay, I don't know what that did. I just wanted to look. Uh oh. Uh oh, what do we do? Hopefully, nothing horrible. Oh, it took us to back to the village. Well, <laughs> that was a little anticlimactic. Climactic. That was different. Huh. Bronze keg, fork, knife, somebody's uh, dinnerware. Did everybody leave? I'm just not seeing anybody right now. Or are we in a different place? I don't even know. Oh, we're in another part of the village. <clears throat> I'm looking for all the uh, goblins. There aren't any here because, well, this isn't the same place. Yeah. Sweeter than a whisper. Weapon blueprints. 
A master blacksmith's work. These? Not too refined here. Just ideas get out. Interesting. I wonder if this is the village this uh, person that was living under the well came from. I don't know, but it's definitely something. I hear something. Oh, is that it? I'm hearing the remains of the windmill. Aren't we? I have no idea. We are in some place completely new. It's colder. Anything in this barrel? No. Fine post. Moonhaven. So this used to be Moonhaven. Fly, birdie, fly. Well, there is something in there. Wonder what? Dabby wooden doors. Porch. Let's see. Send one to Starian. And send a second one to Lathel. Rotten tomato, rotten. This place is creepy. I don't know why. Of the music. Yes, I know it's the blighted villain. That old windmill makes its own sort of music. 
and it isn't pretty yet. Kind of disturbing. There's a campsite here. Abandoned. Roasted meat. Recently abandoned. Perhaps. Rotting basket. Not so recently. I don't know. Might be a good place to pause and try to figure out what's going on with this village. And we will continue <laughs> next time. But until then, bye for now.